Okay. Who are you? Thank you for your help, Doctor. You're here. Thank you. I'll be going. I don't think I helped with this anything. This man, Edward Pierce. His file is incomplete. Mm, it's me. What did Fuller do to him? Okay, I mean, she obviously doesn't know that I'm in her body. Okay. Alright. Now, the boiler room was... Yeah. Hmm, this green shit is not good. I thought that was a body, like, curled up on there for a second. Um, okay, how do I do this? Oh. I can't shut this with my bare hands. I need a tool. A tool? Well, there's a whole bunch of tools here. Can't you just bang it with a hammer or something? Oh. Okay. I haven't seen any tools anywhere, so that's great. All right, let's start off behind here. I don't think the pharmacy has any tools. We were here before. You're gross. Just kidding. Um, yeah, that green stuff is not cool. All right. Ha! Ah, perfect! Ha ah, ah, ha ah. ha! Oh, Escovado, I was just kidding. You're not gross. <laughs> I mean, I assume not. You're a beautiful person. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Alright, perfect. Get out of here. guilty about Elizabeth. But I need the diversion. Poor girl. Okay. Uh, okay, I have to go back to Elizabeth. I'm running in the complete wrong direction, aren't I? No, I'm not. Okay. Hi. Get the water's off again. It's temperamental, if I understand correctly. Dr. Colden, might there be a problem with the water? It might be, Elizabeth. It. it seems it's been cut off yet again. I can't take this, Marie. I feel I'm gonna burst. It's not your fault if we have defective plumbing. And yet, I'm the one who gets punished because I'm gonna have to square off with that annoying old witch. Aww. Courage, Elizabeth. Here we go. And hold your tongue this time. This time? Wow, I would have thought you were a bit too mousy to not hold your tongue every other time. Alright, girl, you can do this. You can do it. All right, let's go around. Okay. At last, the missing files Aha! must be hidden here. The Stendhal syndrome. Hmm. Of course. This Objects is my mental disorder diagnosis for explain. Francis Sanders. Ah, exposure to works of art. Okay, that's interesting. Good. Okay, let's get a quick look on. Really? You don't want to rummage through his drawers? Come on, woman. Something is wrong with these masts. It's oh, yeah. some sort of puzzle. Uh, okay, let's... Oh! Hmm. I see. Oh, no. Okay, that one's... Oh, fucking hell. I'm so bad at puzzles. Okay. Those two are almost right. Okay. Hmm. Hit. 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 Okay, I'll come back to you. I keep looking around. That's the door of his office. More files. Wait. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Try again. Something is wrong with these masts. It's some sort of puzzle. 
Uh, it's not really a puzzle solving game, um, but it, it's a horror game that has puzzle elements in it. Um, luckily I don't, I haven't had to do too many puzzles yet, but I, I am not good at puzzles, like at all, so I'm very sorry. You might just have to bear with me. Eh? Oh, damn it. Oh, I keep managing to do that. Eh? I've unlocked Yay! Patient. Ah, another thingy. Okay. And files. I was right. Does he have a phonograph in here? Yes, he does. Awesome. Conclusions. Session number 17. Patient? Sarah Hawkins. The patient appears to have finally accepted the illusory nature of what she calls mythos. Hello. It goes without saying that it is the duty of the principal twice that comes with her exceptional gifts. Why does Dr. Fuller write psychological reports about Sarah Hawkins? At first, I presumed that her blood was the key. Um, definitely a clue because it's flashing at me. Aha! Why is Ethan on medication? Wait, who's Ethan? On. Maybe I can. Definitely a little fleshy. Ha ha ha! This finger belonged to a woman. Who? What? Why keep it here. That's fucked up, man. The poor souls downstairs are not Fuller's only subjects. Then James came. Charles was keeping secrets from them. I mm. presume that he will try to break into the basement sooner or later. Interesting. I am prepared. The doctor what? Hawkins, Fitzroy and Fuller. What is the connection between these three? Hmm. Of mind to set the mall in the basement. There's no penis man when again. The, fuss about the Hawkins incident finally comes to an end. I will dispose of her belongings. Ah, oh. in the meantime, they must remain hidden in plain sight. Dr. Ethan Fuller. Okay, that makes sense. Okay. Of course. Sarah Hawkins is the connection. Oh man, I'm gonna be in so much trouble. I must go back to the basement. Oh, I'm not in trouble, okay. Oh god, I'm gonna get caught coming out. Can I open this door instead, maybe? I should go another way. Okay. Oh, okay. She didn't see me. Phew! Alright. Where was the basement? Down here? This is not good. I should not be going down here. Oh, it's going to be like American Horror Story where I just get put down here. Why would you risk it? I don't know. Why is it not locked even? Anyone could wander around down here. Um We're just not gonna say anything about this blood. Hi, Doctor. Ah, now that 
That's the Marie that I know. I knew I could count on your scientific curiosity. Yeah. It's time to show you what you were so eager to discover. Oh, I knew it. Didn't I call it? I said before, you should not confront. You should not confront. Is that or is that not what I said? If you're gonna shoot me, at least have the decency to look me in the eyes. Oh, it's Algernon. Turn around. Slowly. But you were dead, bro. Talk, filthy thief. Oh, I swear I'll shoot. Okay. Um. Take a minute to look around. Everything points to Charles Hawkins. He's dead. No. He was here for a very specific item. Oh, no. The book. Why was it in the safe? Have you read it? Uh, Answer kinda. The question. How foolish of you. Now you won't be able to escape his will. I'm gonna follow me what around. What did it show you? <sighs> All right. She went into Fuller's office. She was looking for Sarah Hawkins' corpse. Sarah Hawkins, you say? Let's go back to the start, shall we? Okay. Whose life did the Necronomicon choose to show you? I told you it was a Necronomicon. Dr. Colden. She was at the Riverside Institute. She's in danger. Yep. I have to go. Wait. No one knows the occult better than me. Learn you me might out. need my help. I 100% right. do. All right. I might need you after all. Perfect. Let's meet later at the Hawkins mansion. Okay. Now go. Rescue the doctor. Thank you, Drake. Oh, dear. Whoa. Um, the suspension's not so great on this car. You might want to slow the fuck down, bro. Jeez. Oh, another crow. Or is it a raven? I think it's a crow. Chapter 9. Uh, the book projected Pierce into the body of Dr. Colden. The detective watched helplessly as Bradley's friend carried out her inquiry. Confronted with the experiments of Fuller, she got into his office and discovered that the director of the Riverside Institute was hiding information on, if not the body of, Sarah Hawkins. But she was discovered by Fuller. Pierce must save her before it's too late. Oh no. I mean, it was inevitable though, wasn't it? Just a little bit. A pow. Really? You're just gonna sneak in? You didn't think to call what's his face, Bradley? Oh no! Ethan is 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 um is Bradley. Ethan Bradley. The policeman. I pray that Colden is not the, really here. Not the doctor. And alive. Really? You don't pray that she's at home in bed, where she should be? Nice. Oh, volume one. Uh, her husband John built the first Hawkins home. Ah. 17th century among the first white colonists on the island. Previous inhabitants disappeared three Old centuries diary. earlier. Really? You don't want to look at the medical books that were here? Would you re oh. Fuck yeah. Volume 3. Collection classifies creatures never heard of. Oh yep, same as last time. Ugh. Never don't read a book. <laughs> the Scylla is here. Like in the vision. Yep. Colden came this way. Okay, let's just follow in her tracks. Oh, okay. Nope. Right. Enough time wasted. Oh. Colden needs me. I must find her. Okay. Wow, there's certainly a lot of mist. There's a lot of mist. Oh, shit. Shit, really? Hello? Oh my god. What the what is happening to me? Fuck. Uh Hello? Sir? 
Um What was that? It's as if I'd been transported somewhere else. I have been. This is not a good sign. Okay, this is just the same thing over and over. Hello? Can I go this way, please? Toilet. Nice. Okay. Ah, oh, I see. Why don't you let me go in there? Okay. I go backwards? No. Alright. This is strange. Oh. What happened? Something has changed, but what? Hmm. That ain't right. Yeah, something's totally gonna jump out and bite my face. You should have seen the thing that jumped out of the painting earlier. It was scary. Until it killed me for like the fifth time and I wasn't scared at all anymore because I was just like, for fuck's sake! Alright. Oh, that's not right. Hmm. Okay, I do like the fact that I can't actually hide in the closet, so that means that I'm probably not likely to have to. That way. Hmm. Can't go in there. That's the toilet again. Okay. Can I change? Okay, I can't change my light. Can I pick up this one? Oh, I can. Okay, what was the point of that? Oh. Interesting. Ah. Where have I seen this symbol? Increase your lamp's brightness by pressing. Oh, shit. Whoa! We've talked about this, bro. I don't want to free you. There's something wrong with you. And I do it to this. Oh, okay. Okay, no. No. Well, I can't go that way. Hmm. Why am I breathing so much? Just making it scarier. I'm breathing so hard. I'm gonna run out of oil too, probably. Hello? Oh god. Oh god. Did you hear that? Fuck. Uh, okay. Totally normal. Nothing weird is happening at all. Everything's fine. What's this? Why can't I look at it? Dang it! I get over there. It's like some weird. Nah. Okay. Okay. Hello? Hmm. This is less than ideal. Okay, can't turn that on or listen to the thing. Can't do anything with my lantern. Can't get closer to that. Okay. That's cool. Can't go there. Nothing in here still. Okay. 
strange men's room is blocked that's bricks okay oh have full oil again that still doesn't help I can't go over there in fact I can see even less than I could before What the? Oh god, my oil ran out. This is bad. This is really bad. Oh. <sighs> Could you not, maybe? Oh, I see. It runs out really fast when you do that. Alright, well, I won't do that then. Yeah, I still can't get there. This is where it was before, I think. Or not, I'm not sure where it was. Okay, go in the bathroom. Coming from that way, or...? Right, okay. Got it! It is trapped. Sure has. Okay, um, I'm not sure if I was supposed to swap my lantern or not, but it kind of, I feel like I'm probably supposed to go that way actually. Maybe that way? Hmm. Bathroom, well, toilet rather, there's no bath in there. Alright, let's give it a try. Okay. Through there. Hmm. Okay, I'm sure I can figure out a way to get there. Through the wall again. And again. Oh yeah. Easy. No, nope, get away from me. Oh, damn it. I can hear that creature. Can't hide. Well, that goes outside, so that's not useful. Damn. I'm gonna run out again. Fuck off! Hmm. Damn it. You bastard. How do I get in there? Lock A. Hmm. Okay, I definitely need this other lantern. Yeah, okay, I have full again. Here we go. Bam! Oh shit. Saw it. Saw that beast. That beastie. Okay, there's a light here. Makes me feel vaguely safer for some reason. What the hell am I meant to be doing? This is insane. Oh, hello. Okay, let's follow this. Hello? How? You are confronting powers that surpass you. Nah. That's fine. Don't even worry about it. Aha ha! Pa pow! Yes! You know, honestly, I thought this game would be scary, but it really isn't. Hmm. Boiler room. Okay, you want me to go through that wall? Well, look at that, I can't. Okay. How do I get... How do I get there? 